Welcome to one of these things. Um, are you fucking dumb. So I'm starting this at a very responsible time. It's called 20 to 5. Oh, I've to be back for 8, my mum said. Why 8? Why not 9 like normal? Because it gets darker when it gets closer to winter. Hmm, in which case I suggest we, we go up your to get maximum amount of time. I just come to your place till half past 8 then. Mm -hmm. How you go back? We've got silver and custard creams and junk. Do you still have yours? Yeah. There. Somewhere at the house. I pray they don't get taken. They will. How much money you got? No. I have some something something in the amount of schmeckles. Schmeckles? No. I wanted to buy some schmeckles. Imagine if schmeckles was a real currency. Have you seen some of the weird fucking currencies that have existed over there? There's a weird, there's a video, oh the size of that pill. There's a video you can watch on YouTube, right? And it's, Cody, you, I thought I was going to splash over me then, right? No. There it is. A video on YouTube, like I was saying there. And it's all the weird types of currency that have, or all currencies that have existed throughout time. Fuck, some of them are weird. Who made the video? Fuck cameras, one of these fucking, you know, top 10 lists or fucking, you know those kind of channels? Uh, yeah, that kind of format of channels. I follow a science guy, not Bill Nye. Duh! You want Bill Nye, the bisexual guy, Bill, Bill. Okay, I am now can- Why am I gonna get cancelled? Cody, how have we not been cancelled? That's actually a good question. We should be cancelled. I, I feel like that's something that should have happened by now. Let me see. Oh! Wait, why not? Why not? Oh. We found a penny. It's a penny. I smell pennies. I smell pennies. I smell pen. I smell chill. Wait, I'm not Michael Jackson. <laughs> 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 oh, I saw Alice today. Yeah. Uh -huh. Not vlog at all in the store. Ow. Got my hood up here. Fucking crazy weather. Right. I we did some shopping. We yeah. got rings from H and M. Just my ring. All right, we're doing the ring. And I got to... We got the rings. They're very cheap fucking rings, but they're still rings, and they're still fun. I mean, seven pounds is pretty cheap. Yeah, for rings. We also got Kinder eggs. I got donuts. In fact, I finished the... Yeah, I finished the donuts. I also got bottled lemonade in the bag. Very successful. So the fo that phone charger box only took my phone up to 32%. It's now at 19. Oh. Listen, there'll be a charger in your house I can get a hold of, right? You sure? Yeah. Brilliant. So, we did that. Not too much else related to report, is there? No. Fun, though. Uh huh. I mean, Cody's a crazy with the rings, and this is the only the second ring I own. I uh, got a loan off you yesterday, actually. I traded him an ACDC ring. Are you enjoying the ACDC ring? Duh. Oh, is it on your hand? Yeah. Yeah, that is ACDC ring that I give to a Jewish guy. Oh, I have me, I have a comment. You know the cameras? What? I don't know if it will be allowed. No. Yeah, he does camera work at a college thing. Well, I don't know if we're allowed to keep them or not, but... I doubt it. If we are, then... I'd imagine those cameras... Dog material, maybe? I'd imagine, not really. Because you can record. We can, but it's edit, and I want uh, basically shit we don't have time for. I do these no, vlogs. It would just be the same as this, just. Yeah, but it would take quality. more. But it would take more time to do it that way. The point of these vlogs is they're terrible quality. They're offensive. They they go nowhere. There's random talking like this. Ow. The comments are usually from web people 
saying, Plank to Plank to see naked girls in Russia. Seems to be the one, number one comment on most of these fucking videos lately. Wait, what, actual? <laughs> <laughs> if you ever get a comment, and it's a bunch of layers and numbers, and it's a link, do not fucking click. That is not a joke, do not click. Yeah, just don't. Just, just, just don't, just don't do anything ever. But yeah, that, that, that was the funny part, admittedly. So it's currently 10 to oh. 6. So I'll get it back to your I place. I believe yesterday morning, uh, I went onto the Rocket League. You're all awesome. I, I played a match. I joined in a match with someone. We won. Mm-hmm. Uh, he asked me to trade with him. So, right. I traded. Oh, nice. I gave away things that I didn't want anymore. Cup. I gave away a couple... <coughs> a couple vehicles. Yes. No. And also, a good thing, can't trade the Ecto-1, the Fast and Furious cars and all that. I cannot trade those. So... Do you know one thing I loved with GTA Online, of course? The fact that you could get rid of your ownership so if you paid up, this was a mod that everybody does. So if you buy a car off this gift car off the street, also you, you you don't have to insure it to do it. But certain cars that you cannot go to the pain spray, I think. Oh, no, wait, wait. certain expensive customs. No, not that. Um, certain high end cars, if you steal them, will not go in your garage. It will tell you to buy them offline at stupid prices. If you take any car off the street and add a certain horn, the horn to costs ten grand. The car will instantly be worth twenty five thousand. And you can sell it for that to the pain spray. The fuck? That was how I made money when I first started on there. Basically selling cars that you can only do it every so often. But fuck. Because the cheapest house in GTA is 87 grand. That's the cheapest house. Yeah. Well see, would you rather pay that or would you rather walk about with nowhere to stay and just use a car to live in, which doesn't really work. Do you know for a while I did actually list but apart from the grand one. What is the actual cheap, cheapest house? That is 87,000 is the cheapest. You don't rent, you have to buy outright. There's no mortgage or rent, you just have to pay up front. So you will have to pay, you know, 87 grand and it's in the, it's in the city, it's near the beach. But it's a city apartment. The most what is the one near the construction site? Oh, fuck. And that's what, a one million? How the fuck did my brother get it then? Heist. It does take a lot of work. It's not something you can do quickly. Most expensive thing oh, I ever bought... We haven't had it for long. The most expensive thing I ever bought in GTA Online for f 5 mil was the DeLorean. Mm. That's how much that car costs in that game. It's 5 mil. But to be fair, you can set it up to shoot fucking rocket launchers and it can fly. Hold up. What do you think about this? I believe I... I don't know how much I paid for the delivery. Sometimes it goes on sale for four. No. No, I'm talking about in Rocket League. Oh, you probably did not pay anyone here what it costs in GTA. To fair though, in GTA it is basically fucking theft. How much is five million in real life for GTA? I don't think you can buy it. You can buy the short cards for a certain amount of grand. I think for eight mil, it's a hundred pound of our money. See, when you start the game though, you can get a short car when you buy the game for free. I think it's for a hundred sure? and it's for a hundred grand. So that's how I got my first house, although in my PS4, but when I got that game originally 360 back in 2013, oh, I, I spent, I spent, how many months do you think it took me to build a four a fucking house, the cheapest house? Mm. It took me a month and a half to afford that constant grinding though. Yeah. That's a real grind, bro. Here's the problem. See the first, like, three weeks, though? Mm. I may have spent the money upgrading a fucking car that I had nowhere... The problem is, I had nowhere to put the car when I wasn't using it. You have to buy a storage unit if you're not going to buy a house. So that's fucking annoying. Uh. Currently on GTA 4 and Wine, I own a penthouse. I own two homes. I own a luxury apartment. I, you know the casino? I own a casino penthouse. Basically, above the casino building, you can have a luxury apartment. 
cost me three point. Wait, not three. I think it cost about five or six mil. So that's now my most expensive purchase. Yeah, the uh, DeLorean. Oh, by the way, I don't have that DeLorean anymore. Okay. I sold the DeLorean. For how much? See a pair of it. Wait, I got it on sale for four and a half mil, I think. And I sold it for. Considering, right? I bought the mobile command center, I think it is. And if you buy that, you can fucking upgrade fuck out the door and add in rocket launchers and shit. So I think the all-in result for that ended up being... Hmm. Oh, uh... I sold it for more... Cody. I sold it for six fucking... I paid... I sold, I sold it for six mil. I sold the fucking DeLorean for six mil. Damn. To be fair though, I had that DeLorean... I don't know how long it is in game time, but for about... I go see. I got that DeLorean in 2018. Had it all the way up to the start of 2020. That's one of the cars I've owned the longest in that game. There's not many that I keep that long. Some of them I will keep for like a month or two. Then fucking either. Well, mind you, I have about five or ten cars. You now you can insure them, and when they're destroyed, you can phone them back. I have about ten cars that I should really fucking pay the insurance to give me back. I have about ten cars. A lot of them are fucking luxury for Porsches and Ferraris. They've either been destroyed by other players, stolen, then crashed, or I've just fucking crashed them like an idiot. Going to driving too fast. Having the gas. Round corners, uh, in particular. And I should really call the fucking insurance company to get them cars back. I have a car that I, I, I it's a 1972, and it's a Ferrari. Fucking crazy car. I should really get it back. We are definitely going to the transport museum one week. Like one day Me, or another. I love cars and I know you do as well. Yes. I think I'm the bigger and one. Also, and also, we want to see Human Frigate's motorbike again. Aye. Uh, yeah. Plus, they got some really cool fucking cars. A couple of which I've actually had a go and I have driven. Stephen knows. Do they have uh, Aston Martin? The only car no. in the Transport Museum that I know of, that I know that I've driven, is a Tabot Sunbeam. Go on, you, go on the internet and Google a 1970s Tabot Sunbeam. Or I've got a we can just look at it when we ever go. No, but I don't think we're watching it. They're not coming up. I don't like extra guests! <laughs> it's not copyrighted oh, here. No, yeah, no. The mouse's ghostly howl speaks claim to Go. Who's that? I fought that. Is it Dutch or something? Swedish. Of course. Same thing. Space balls. Yeah. Old helmet. Also, I could do something on the break, but it just doesn't work. But yeah. So I'm not doing really too much at all right now. Fox and Virgin Break season three episode nine boxed in. But yeah, so me and Corey and I, we didn't vlog too much at his place because there's so many people over. And by the way, you might get to see some of his place in the next vlog. It is crazy because we would have much decoration. There's been a lot of changes there. Um, I'm going over close to that window. Over there. Yeah, there and shut the door. Just finished this one and had some ice cream.
song. Given the fact that it's 10 o'clock, um, well, a couple of minutes past 10 nearly, um, you know, I'm probably going to get a whole lot more to go. These vlogs, because of certain fine crap I'd put on this one, um, basically 30 minutes seem to be the new standard for a vlog, which isn't too bad. This one definitely will be some sort of a different length. This one will not be exact 30 minutes, but who knows. I don't know, do you guys like these being more compact? I'm not sure. Who knows, I'm still in disbelief that we're on the 1st of October. Speaking of things, um, I'm no longer going to buy a Lyle set this month. I've kind of thought to myself, I might not get paid in uh, this month, October or November, so I'm keeping a hold of that money. And if I get paid this month, next month, I have more money. My plan, wait till, wait till December. What I'm going to do is I'm going to buy all my gifts in that early in December. And then, maybe just after December or something, I'm going to treat myself to something good. I'm going to wait a few months. See, I'm still going to get myself a Star Wars episode 2 set, but there's not that many episode 2 sets for my budget. There's a few, but I'm thinking, hmm, I want something that really fills this, this shelf space. Like an ATTE, a gunship, the Slave 1, the Duon Geonosis, something a bit bigger. So, basically, I'm just going to save the money from here on out. So, I'm going to go back to watching Prison Break. I'm not sure when the next update will be. It was after wait and see. Welcome to the um, half past 11 update. I'm tired. Uh, so, I'm watching Prison Break. I'm on season 3, episode 11, under an out. Um, I mean, some photography stuff. It's basically taking pictures for the Instagram account. I'm, you know, using the little thing with the right dioramas and stuff. I've got 216 followers in a couple of days, so obviously with some people that's, that's nothing. You know, some people that's, you know, I don't find they get that, but some people probably get that, you know, every few minutes. But you know what, I'm going to start on edge of this, see where it goes. Plus, you know, it's fun. Um, your final update will be a lot longer than this, which will come at 5 to. Um, I'm totally tired here. So yeah, I'll see you guys at 5 to. Hopefully it's a bit longer than this. So here we are at 5 minutes 2 and I can't find my goddamn watch. Frustrating. Too much going on watching prison break still. In fact, if memory serves me, I think season three doesn't have that too many episodes. Let me check. So if I want episode 12 of season three, oh, there's only 13 episodes in season three. So series three. Series five have the least amount of episodes. All right, that makes sense. But yeah, we're just escaping out of the prison in sauna. Try this new angle. And I can be comfortable and talk. But yeah, today and yesterday have been great. Obviously, having Cody back is. Obviously, we have not been the greatest of our life, but who knows, maybe we'll stay with you 30 minutes. Because, you know, we'll always use up the full amount of time. And today came with some opportunities. Shit time here. Three minutes through. Today came with some opportunities. It was quite good. I spoke to a f friend, and there's a possibility, a real possibility, that I could find work. Because that would be great. You know, or, you know, they, they have a few jobs on the side, but they get in on that. That'd be brilliant as well, you know, that would really help me financially. Because, you know, that'd be great. Speaking of finances, I'm not going to buy any Lego sets this month, right? Um, 
the only thing you will be buying is the Marvel CMX. Because I'm generally going to just get five ones and figures. The problem with collecting CMX or anything like that is the more you get, the more of a complete collection you get. Like, for instance, I've got five to go. The more likely I'm going to get a lot more doubles before I get those last five. Because back in, I think it was February, me and Cody collected the Lego CMX Series 21. And honestly, we should make a video showing that off the amount. The absurd amount of double mini figures we got was crazy. We got all of them. So far, I've not got any doubles with this. I've actually been quite lucky if I've got any doubles. I'm pretty happy about that. Um. Well, me and Cody have decided to help us both financially. We're only going to get them once a week on a Wednesday. So that saves money as well. Two minutes till. And speaking of my plan not to buy any Lego sets, it's because of the bulk of money. See this month, I've got the cinema. I don't know if that's still happening 100%. I'm sure it's for my dad's birthday. I'm sitting £83 right now. Not bad. My plan is basically to try and take as much of that, give as much money back as possible, hopefully, consider any expenses and don't spend any money during the month. My plan is, right? to go all the way up to December and say like, because I'm going to get all my stuff bought, you know, for Christmas or a week or two early, and then on Christmas Day or a few days before, I might just buy myself something cool. Basically say I put 50 quid, and I don't know people do 50 quid a month, but near enough that 50 quid a month until December, that's £200, because I've already got one of them. I've already got, you know, one of those 50. And I want to buy a couple of episode two sets. That would really set me up. Um, but yeah, how long is it going? Well, count down, count down till October second. Come on, you want quick over, quick over. Yay! It is officially October. Saturday, October 2nd. Wow. It is both fun and a depressing statement. So, yeah, I'm going to get back to watching Prison Break. Um, but I enjoyed the whole chat with you guys. Anyway, see you tomorrow. We're more than guaranteed to see Cody tomorrow as well, so that's cool. So, see you guys in the next vlog. Peace out.